Hello, everybody. The Rising Tide came out. This DLC is probably going to take me to hopefully today and tomorrow. Yeah, so this is the Rising. This DLC, they said, is going to be hard. Scooter Miner is self 14. There you go. Uh, they definitely were like, hey, yeah, don't forget how to play this when you uh, maybe brush up on what to do. I did like a little bit of that, but. I'm going to say I just figured out as we go. So I think it's if we needed the book. These are. Uh, I, I know the quest is available nearby, but where? I thought it said. Are these just. The oh, there we go. I shall not waste time mincing words. Python's dominance in need of a rescue, and despite my numerous misgivings about joining hands with an outlaw of the highest dispute, this dispute, Dame has assured me there is none better suited for the task at hand. I not reveal more, for the missive could fall in the wrong hands. What little I have penned here has kindled your interest. I bid you journey to the Vale in Northreach. Fire with one Layla. She will surely see you satisfied. Was that the, um... And the lady who runs the um the Leviathan the Lost Ruffle? Who I know after all this time. Also how's the volume he's actually talking. Why what now? No. I'm not sure you believe me if I told you. After all we've been through. I doubt there's anything that could surprise me at this point. <laughs> All right, then. Rouse Joshua and meet me in the mess. We'll talk there. Boy. Yeah, it's it's a very different, like, style to everything, too. I see we're all here. So, what is it this time? I'm not sure yet. The letter delivered to my chambers omitted a few crucial details. Do we know its provenance? That was one of the details it omitted. But whoever the sender was, it seems the dame held them in high enough regard to point them in our direction. The dame? Well, she's not one to waste our time. It must be important. Important might be an understatement. If the letter is to be believed, Leviathan's dominant is in danger. And someone wants us to save him. Well, Leviathan. They didn't know that Leviathan was still around. So the Warden of Water has finally returned. What has it been? A hundred know. years? More. The lost moniker dates back at least that long. Even our venerable Lawsman would not have been so much as a glint in his father's eye when last the mighty serpent brought his crushing waves to bear upon not. the realm. And if... But why the gap? Under a new era. Well, no, it can be a few years before a new dominant's born. But over a century? And hiding. Should the dominant of water's bloodline have been severed somehow, it could have prevented a new dominant from awakening. But if one has awakened now, he couldn't have chosen a worse time. Every nation in the realm has lost its dominant. If word gets out that there is still one to be had, they will stop at nothing to claim it for their own. Hey, this is a spoiler for 16. War again, this is very end game. Just when content. humanity most needs to come together. Did the letter say anything else? Only that if I wish to know more, we must meet in person. And that the Vale can arrange a meeting. Hmm. If nothing else, you can be certain it ain't a trap. <laughs> Famous last words. <laughs> I'm coming with you. Yes, as good. am I. Thank you. Both of you. And Otto? Yeah, yeah. I'll keep an eye on things here. Didn't fancy coming anyway. <laughs> Thank you. I shall leave the Invincible in your capable hands. Hey. The new area, hopefully. Uh, 
Um, destination for the rising tide indicated that marker. Yeah, no. All the main, all the main game stuff has already been done, so we're just hanging off. It is a little bit worrying that they mentioned that this is going to be harder because it took me a few tries to beat Omega Weapon in the old DLC, so that should be the garrison fun. Said they take another hundred of me. I'm expecting at least to be some is, then. regular combat before we start getting to anything that difficult. At least I can take the rust off. Yeah. Then again, it only like killed me a few fast. times because it Not had a stupid, talk. like, instant kill move. I can also probably just adjust. It's probably a noise gate. Yeah, I understand that, so I'm trying to fix it right now. Okay, there we go. Does that sound any better? Am I still cutting out in here? Fancy a peek behind the veil, my lord? Well, I... There you go. Take it easy, bug. Hopefully have a good rest. Mona, welcome in. Hello, Layla. I'm looking for a Layla. Found her. <laughs> You found one. So, will your friends be joining in? <laughs> or just watch? Jill's face! <laughs> Yike. Uh, we're not here for your services. We simply want to talk. <laughs> what you do with your time is up to you. The price is still the same. <laughs> Show where the letter stops. <sighs> Yeah, thank you. We hear about the letter. <laughs> there you go. No. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> sorry. I suppose you'll be wanting to know who wrote it then. Among other things. <laughs> Look, I'm just the messenger here. There's only so much I can tell you. So weird. They're like, like the spies of the city. North of town, on the shore of Eulafeist Bay. There, you'll find a tent and the woman who can answer your questions. And that's all. Nothing else. Ask you. Actually, one thing. There's more than flowers in the meadows these days. So keep that sword him. of yours to hand. Well, of course he's going to be fighting. That I knew. Does anyone else think it's strange that this woman should prefer to keep to the outskirts of town? Not if she realizes the value of the information she's party to. And the danger it puts her in. Like, this shouldn't have been any different than any of the other stream. All right, well, I'll try it this way. Maybe I went the wrong direction this time. The garrison may have kept the rights from the wall. Yeah, but I figure somebody would have mentioned if it was cutting out before. I would hope. Wait, can I get out this way? Yeah, right over. No, I don't think I can. Crap. Oh yeah, there's a the doorway's right here. Uh, now the other question is, how did I? Not that. There we go. Okay. Uh, sprint. Yeah. Sprint. There we go. Oh, so something gonna fight us over here? Is that why they were like, "Oh, make sure you get your sword ready." Well, the tent is where Layla said it would be. Yes, but who awaits us inside? There is no one in the tent. Just kidding. DLC is over. Hmm. It's empty. Why am I not surprised? Never that easy. 70 gigabytes. Yeah, it's a few. That's, that's quite a name over there. <laughs> How you doing?
Oh wait, there's a boat down there. That water looks awfully choppy though, so I don't know how that boat Both. is no not being dashed against those rocks. To. This is Final Fantasy 16. This is the new DLC for. Oh, right. They made it easy to do this now. Get it, boy. Except Clive still gets in the way. But that's fine. Torga got a treat. That's what's important. The embers are still warm. It, you can see the smoke coming off it, Clive. So you're Sid. Why does she sound like the shopkeeper lady? Yep. Start with the shot right of her ass. I suppose I must be. Which means you have me at a disadvantage. A cool weapon, though. Apologies. I am Shula. Tributary of Mesidia. Final haven of the Morts of Water. Using accent she's got. Motes of water. The very tribe into which it was believed Leviathan's dominant was born. Yes, they've been hiding the people Leviathan, notable they? for their sapphire eyes and ivory hair. Yes, that would be impossible, since the tribe famously vanished. Was exterminated. Oh, silver hair, she's a scion. <laughs> Despite the best efforts of both church and state, we are still very much alive. Though we've managed to keep that fact hidden from good Grieger's faithful for over a century. Then why are you here Along just announcing that? Leviathan is dominant. That wave out there. What do you know of it? Frozen wave. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. The surge. Only that it's been there a long time. Since the fall of Drake's Eye almost a century ago. Some claim the two are connected, but none can speak with any certainty. So in other words, you know nothing. Not that I'll hold it against you. How the hell would we? The wave was raised by Leviathan in an act of rage. So yeah, we figured that, but how did he? Moments how did before they the waters it? were stayed, and the icon and its dominant bound within. And you want us to rescue him? So yes. I was right a long time ago you that see, Leviathan was in. A little it. bird told me about a certain outlaw with a singular knack for putting unruly dominance in their place. And ours is about as unruly as they get. For years, we've searched for someone who could hold their own against an icon. I'm so Leviathan's been stuck in that all that someone time. Just like you. So what do you say? I wonder this fight's gonna be hard as hell. Will you help us? What exactly did your dominant do to warrant this punishment? Huh. What did he do? He committed the greatest crime one of his kind can. Oh, it's oh right, born. it's this this again, right? But he deserves a better fate than the one my people forced upon him. He deserves to be free. <laughs> so wait, did the other people all. know that we're being like brought to deal with Leviathan? Very well. Far-fetched though your tale may seem. Something tells me you speak in earnest. So we will do what we can for your dominant. But first, you will tell us everything you know about him and the means of his imprisonment. Also, Moon and I can Wolfman. do better than that. You bring us there. I can show you. Care to take a trip across the bay? My people also, are waiting we have there. a boat. Why didn't we just Lead go the there? Like, we have a, a more than, like, this rickety little dinghy over here. Yeah, Moon and Winstruck, welcome in. Thank you for the follows. How are you doing today? How was your weekend?
Like, it clearly wasn't even that far. Why didn't we just... Like, our hideout's here? Somewhere. Well, I don't even remember why they were actually docking the boat. A Bayonetta? It's not quite that much of an action game. I think Bayonetta is still, like, a little more crazy. How you doing, Wyvern? Or go way up front. Oh, that wave looks so cool All back right. there. You might want to hold on to something. We're coming up on the wall, and passing through can take a bit of getting used to. Wait, what? I don't see any wall. Of course you don't. That's the point. <laughs> it's a glamour woven by our ancestors to keep our village hidden from prying eyes. Magic wall. But don't take my word for it. Watch. I am not taking the advice of holding on to something. Oh, it's so bright. Uh, we're playing the DLC to Final Fantasy 16. Oh, that was worse than oh, look, a it's, everything's Back not purple wine. again. Clive, we have colors. Sky. It's blue, but how is that possible? You do know what a glamour is. Don't you? Oh, this is what the game used to, to look like. Ways, and a good thing too. I wouldn't fancy staring at those sickly clouds every day. <laughs> My god, it's gorgeous. It's such a bummer part of the game at the ending is everything gets so purple. And that concludes our little voyage. We're here. <laughs> A blue sky again. It's so nice. I forgot about our glowy sword too. It's a long slog to the village, and a hard one. Could you I, put your dock uh, a little closer? Hope you're up for a climb. I mean, to be honest, that hill doesn't look like that bad of a. Oh, didn't even make us actually do the climbing. Okay. Four. Finally. What? You didn't think we'd arrived, did you? <laughs> the village isn't up here. It's on the other side of the mountain. Oh, of course it is. <laughs> hey, we got a fast travel. All right. Oh, it automatically activated. All right, Shula, let's go. Wait, party makeup has changed. Oh. It was the party then. Or is it just that Shula is following us now? Oh. Ah, uh, sky. Oh, the waterfalls out here too. This path can be treacherous. If Listen, not for the I can sheer fly, drop, it's then fine. for the beasts who prowl it. Thank you for the warning. And please, call me Clive. Sid. Remember correctly, items, items just pick up ladies. automatically. Yep. You will be pleased to learn, Lady Shula, that I have no such aliases. Good for you, Joshua. Is that so, Lord Margrace? <laughs> Damn. It's all the same to me. Instantly called out. Hit his ass, Jill. They just was there sprinting? What about? Let's see if I can remember how to do this. Stand back. We'll handle this. Oh, will you now? Shall I keep my axe and spells to myself then? <laughs> oh, but what the hell is hitting? 
It put me to sleep? Excuse me. He, yes, that's exactly what it was doing. And he's unconscious again. Great. I'd wake up already. Hey, you. Right here. Charge magic. Hey, you. Okay, we're getting, we're getting there. Earlier you mentioned spells, yet I see you carry no crystals. Oh yeah, actually. Since when did a bearer ever need crystals? But then, where is your brand? Did they not brand Waiting people here? Waiting for me in Sunbreak, if I ever get yeah. careless. <laughs> then it's in for a long wait. Yeah, of course they wouldn't be branding people here. Hello, wolf. There. Oh. I don't know if I actually dodge something or I still get hit by it. Off the cliff with you, wolf. Hey, Sasa. Should be able to. This. Should. Should switch, I think. Yeah, there we go. All right, that actually worked. Uh, okay. We're almost at the summit. From there, you'll have a better view of our home. Yes, please give me views. Few have ever set eyes on what I'm about to show you. Just so you know. This is not what I expected. Welcome, my friends, to Did Mercidia. You... Oh, wow. Are they keeping the wave frozen? Yeah, I think they are. Hey, it's yeah, there's also no light. Since I saw the north looking so. so. alive. How I'm is... sure you mm. have plenty of questions, but it's been a long journey, and I expect we could all do with a rest. <laughs> Except there's so many questions about, like, village where's the blade? It's only a short way from here. If you'd care to accompany me. There are. Let's get ourselves in front of a fire. The, uh, like, ancient and I'll tell you everything you need to know. Hey, Myrna. Am I looking? Wait, what am I looking at? Like the landscape? The gorgeous greenery that's it's never anywhere else in this game anymore? Shula. And we aim to keep it that way. I remember correctly, not everything wants to kill me, right? So these deer are just gonna. Yeah, they're just gonna hang out here. Just fight. kidding. They apparently do want to fight. Sorry, Vex. You, you asked for this. No, I was just gonna leave them alone. Oh right, level ups. And I think level fifty was. I bumped into it. Well, it should learn to not be so easily offended. Um, level fifty the max, or did they up the level again? Oh, it says I still have experience to level up. All right. If I remember right, the like Final Fantasy mode added more ex no more levels, I think. Are those stones glowing? That's one of the cairns which maintain the glamour. Stay well clear. Oh, I don't like how she worded that. We're we gonna like end up dropping the glamour and like showing this to everyone at some point. Yeah, we'll <laughs> I just wanted to use magic, not accidentally gale it. Soil and stone. Goodbye, wolf. Easy. It's a Final Fantasy thing. If Howdy, this gal. search was an act of rage, one wonders what prompted it. 
Uh, well, we know how all the dominants were treated outside of here, so I'm gonna say it was probably deserved. I don't remember if you were gonna play this at some point, Gal, but just heads up, this is like end game stuff here, so. That's, oh, I was on the wrong element, I guess. Still effective though. Hey, Sully, welcome. He does a lot of yelling. Thankfully, he's not doing what he was before when I was doing the um, like training mode. Every time he would change to a different dominant, he would yell its name. And it got very old. Could but for some reason, he was only doing it in there. The mountain crossing by landing further north? <laughs> in clear view of the bear. Oh, I was right. They don't know we're coming, do they? I guess that's a path to somewhere else, so we'll later. On evening tides. Does morning's light return? Oh, they're like super prepared. Open the gates. On top of the glamour. The also home. like secret phrases. Interesting. Hey, Andre, this is Final Fantasy 16's DLC. Can't wait to hear how everything still looks like this. Or is this also just the glamour? Outsiders? Well, I never. Look at the size of that dog. <laughs> All right, now. Back to your duties. You'll have to forgive my people, their curiosity. We don't get many visitors. Yeah, it sounds like in any of their lifetime they wouldn't have seen anyone from outside. This is quite extraordinary. Like stepping into another world. So do you believe me now? You've made it difficult not to, my lady. But how did your people chance to settle here in the They're north? Just farming. It Unless works. I am much mistaken, the moats of water long called the coasts of Southern Ash their home. Until Drake's horn fell and the blight forced them ever inland, where we He's met just our reciting doom, books, yeah. along with our dominant. I see you've read the Gregorian Church's account, but perhaps you'd like to hear ours. Yes, that building go. over there is the Witten Hall. It's where my people gather to discuss matters of import. We can speak more inside once the place is ready to receive you. It shouldn't take long, but oh, you're welcome to explore up. the village while I see to things. Thank you. We'll do just that. What's interesting too, Andrea, is this isn't even the graphics mode. This is the frame rate mode. That'll be uh, them then. Don't look like much if you ask me. Good. She said, well, it doesn't look like much if you ask me. You know what, lady? I wasn't asking you. How about that? It's not a blacksmith. Look, that one's got a black cape. Do you think he's the leader? I can hear you, children. I'm right here. Uh, maybe I didn't see a blacksmith? Oh, yeah, it's right here, buddy. Although I don't think they're gonna let me do anything until I go to the building. We must flee. Buddy, you watched me walk in the gate. They're the tributary's guests. After what their kind did to us. It's it's wrong. Okay, old man. No, do you think he bites? Who? The hound? Or his master? Damn, lady. I don't even I don't know what to make of that one. 
Wow. <laughs> so what do you think of our little haven in the woods? It's beautiful. It might not have all the comforts of a southern settlement, but at least it's ours. And there's a lot to be said for that. It can't have been easy keeping this place a secret. Not easy, no. We've dedicated our lives to maintaining the glamour that conceals us. Us and Walius. Hi. This man, Walius, is he Leviathan's dominant? That's right. Though he's no man, uh, what? Walius is still a baby. A baby? Huh? <sighs> Forgive me. But you Have said fun, that the Dominant and his Icon were bound inside the Surge almost a century ago. That would surely make him older still. Not if he's been frozen. It would, if he'd been allowed to age. But the spell robbed the poor bairn of even that. I'm sorry. Writing a baby? Walius was the son of my great-grandfather. Leviathan awoke within him almost immediately. But instead of allowing the lad to live out his life as a valued member of the community, my ancestors sought to put his power to other uses. Sadly for them, the icon sensed their treachery and summoned a wave so large it would have swallowed the entire village if my ancestors hadn't stopped him. Then it is not the surge that binds the child, but time itself. Yes. The beam going to it, I'm guessing. Forgive me. I'm still not sure I understand. I'm not surprised. It isn't the easiest thing to explain. If the fight a baby, Clive. Which is why it might be better if I took you to see him. Show you exactly what he has to endure. <laughs> I can't believe our final, be, our final battle is against a baby. Then let us be off. There's a road that leads north from the village. It'll take us right into the surge. Yeah, that was the road I saw. So it's a good thing I didn't go the other way. I definitely know how to throw you off with this are game, you bound though. For the wave, tributary. We are, Delina. Have you spread the word about our guests? Are you companions, too? I have. Everyone knows to treat them as family. Except the elder who just yelled at me. You shouldn't have any trouble now, but just in case. Oh no, not I would these have you again. This symbol of our people. I forgot about this. <laughs> you get, wait, oh, that's right. Oh. That's very kind. I look forward to meeting the family. Uh, all the pins. The feelings lovely. mutual. Should the tributary be indisposed, feel free to ask me any questions you might have regarding the village, and mm. I'll do my best to answer. Thank you. We will. Then I bid you good tide. All right, let's see the wave. Our oh, storehouse there is. lies across the bridge. There's like quests and stuff supplies, here too. All right. You may find what you need there, though we will have to ask you for recompense, poor as we are. We got side quests. Sid. What's up, lady? You are Sid, aren't you? The man the tributary told us about? Are there many other people that don't look like they belong me. here? With what exactly? Oh, nothing too troublesome. Do you know my husband, Pavart? He's the village smith, among among other things. Anyway, mm. his name day is not far off, and I wanted to make a gift for him. He's a <laughs> craftsman, you see, and he's been fretting about running low on the flowers he uses for dye making, so I wondered if you might collect some for me and give them to him. His uh, birthday? Would this gift not be better coming from you? Perhaps, but it can't for reasons I can't go into. It's as suspicious Please, as hell. I know it sounds daft, but I'd be ever so grateful. <laughs> sure, lady. Fine. Which flowers does your husband need? Hmm. <laughs> The sweet little blue ones that grow around the fount. Elder's blessings, they're called. 
We use them to dye our fabrics so we we'll always feel close to water like they are. You don't need to go to the trouble of picking them yourself, though. Just speak to the field hands and ask them to share their harvest with you. Oh. Two basketfuls should be enough for my husband to be getting on with. Two basketfuls it is. Not only do I not have to pick them, I just go over to someone else and ask them for their flowers. Okay, sure. There's some battle with the <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's really something. <laughs> yeah, this person you just met. Hey, you want to go do something for me? Just go collect this stuff to give to my husband for his birthday so he has more work to do? Like, huh? I'm not arguing. The child must be saved. But does it have to be them that do it? If Again. It's them, then who? I don't see you running off to the search. I'm right here. Very rude. <laughs> Excuse me, you don't know me, but can I have those? Excuse me. I wonder, might you be able to spare a basket of Elder's Blessings? Pavard's wife tasked me with collecting some for her husband and suggested that I speak to it's you. so ah. Word of wants you to bless a better half with the fruits of our labor, does she? <laughs> yes, literally. Go on, then. Give the old fool something to squirm about. Wait, what? I'm sorry. Ah, don't worry about it. Oh no, what are they setting me up for? An old fool pervert may be, but if you come bearing gifts, he's not fool enough to turn you away. Um, Even robbery. Uh, glad to hear it. <laughs> Thank you. We're being set up for something here. The name of the quest, it's the thought that counts. Welcome to Haven, friend. Hi, I know you're working, you. but can I take those? Forgive my presumptuousness, but the smith's wife has asked me to make her husband a present of some elder's blessings. Oh, two basketfuls, to be precise. Well, I have one, if that's any help. One whole basket. It is. I'm much obliged. They really are beautiful. Aren't they just? Though that's not the only reason they have a special place in our hearts. Legend has it that when our people fled from Ash, the tributary of the time took some seeds with them. And as they wandered high and low across the twins, he'd plant them wherever they stopped for water. Every elder since has done the same. So when we finally put down roots here in Mesidia, the flowers did too. Are we on different heights or is everyone in here just really short? Well, that's two basketfuls. Oh, okay. She's whoop. Oh yeah. They added this since we played last. There's like a thing to just immediately travel back to the Time person to who the quest. Which why not? Oops. Why not? I have to hold it. A nice touch, but not too... Yeah, I just wish that some of those things would have come when we were still playing it. Like, the, um... They added a lot more, like, banter between the party, but I'm not gonna replay the whole game just to find out what those things are. What do you want? Damn. Your wife asked me to bring you these flowers. <laughs> gonna be something. There, here you go. Have some flowers, pal. That woman. <laughs> Come out. I know you're there. Yeah, what are you setting us up for here? H who? Me? <laughs> hmm. Would either of you care to explain what's going on? Yeah, what are you, what are you, what are you doing sorry. here? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to deceive you. I feel like you did, though. It's just... My husband can be a bit standoffish at times, and I thought this might be a good way for the two of you to get acquainted. I bring him flowers? What with you being a swordsman like, and him being the only smith in the village? It'd be a shame if you couldn't turn to him for help. The only reason he couldn't turn to me for help is because I had my hands full with all the orders you lot dumped on me. <laughs> I'm pretty much done with them now, though. But, for the record, the tributary said that we were to lend you outsiders our aid, <laughs> and that's exactly what I was planning to do. 
with or without my darling wife's meddling. Still, here we are, acquainted. So if there's out you need, just bring us the materials, all right? So we never like talked right. to this guy to find out if he even like didn't right, want to work with us. So that we, lady. And tar for the flowers. I was running low. You use them for dying, I hear. Ridiculous. I crush the petals and it makes a fine and lasting blue. We use it to stain the cloth for our tunics and pennons. To remind us where we come from, like. As motes of water. Children of the sea. That's right. The pattern too was left by our ancestors. The ceaseless rill, it's called. It symbolizes the river of our tribe, with the strength of Leviathan running through it. And no matter how that river has ebbed and flowed, changed its course, the flowers have always been with us, growing on our banks. <clears throat> I should get back to work. If you need something crafting, let me know. Yeah, they mentioned that. It was a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Wasn't it just? Maybe. Uh, so yeah, they mentioned that all the people here have white hair and blue eyes. Whatever, I'll take free experience, actually. Oh, and actual accessories. Sweet. Okay, so now we can use the blacksmith. Have any of materials? I reckon I my Is steel's that? just as good as any. Well, these are all not good weapons. Okay. I need this. Oh, there was not much good point in getting here. that blacksmith. All right. But you Billos. Oh, I'll have her hide when she gets back. <laughs> Hello oh. there. Sorry. I was legs away. How can I help you? If you're after something from the storehouse, it's actually my wife you'll want to talk to. She will have to charge you for the goods, though. Not that would fleece you or anything. It's just, you know. Needs must. I understand. Saying that, mm -hmm. she might not be able to get anything down for you for a bit. Ah, oh, right. She's got her hands full with the inventory, you see. It should have been my daughter's job, really, but the willful little rills decided to make herself scarce. Oh, the heavens all need know where that girl's got to. If you'd like me to keep an eye out for her. Oh, no. I couldn't ask that of an outsider. Could I? Uh, yeah, <laughs> unless. Yeah, sure, buddy. Of course not. Find your child. She won't have gone far, will she? I hope not. But I've scoured the entire village for her and come up empty handed. Can't help thinking she might have gone on another one of her little adventures. Ah. Oh, a free spirit, is she? <laughs> Aye, Why do you that put it she like is. That? Can't get her to sit still. Especially once you heard you lot were on your way. Outsiders! You should have said a little eyes light up. <laughs> oh, if she wanted to watch you arrive, she should have made for the low gate where you first came in. The guard there might have spotted her. Maybe you could ask him. Uh, Ruka, her name is. All right. I'll let you know if I find her. Try not to worry. Where's he going? I thought he was over here working. Yeah, okay. We didn't have anyone. Stop totally making a lot of noise there. Uh, sort of missed the pet there, Clive, but use any character. Nope, only Clive. Hear me, my ancestors. Bit of a bummer, but yeah, you only play as this guy. I was like. These two both fight, 
they just kind of and they're they fight on their own excuse me you haven't seen the storekeeper's daughter have you little ruka i have as it happens she went out through the gate not long ago just let her go out of the village alone aye she does it all the time there's a path off to the left which leads down to the river nice little spot that and safe as you like the beast of the mountain don't dare come so close to the village except this time that's where she'll be <laughs> go and have a look if you don't believe me i will So apparently this wasn't the way to the wave, this is the river. So I think we have to go through the village. This must be the path. Alright, Ruka. Please don't be dead from monsters. There she is. Oh, they're not here either. They're behind you. Haha. -ha. It's you! <laughs> I've been looking everywhere for you. You must be Ruka. You know my name? Can you lot read minds? <laughs> Your father asked me to keep an eye out for you. Yeah, the you accents are a little telling him where you were going. Kind of like all over the worried. place. But I went to look for you. Well, now you found me. Hmm. What do you say we head back to the village and let your father know you're safe? All right. And on the way home, you can tell me all about the world beyond the wall. I want to know everything. <laughs> everything might be a stretch. Hey, child, you don't want to know what's going on out there. And oh, wait, all right. Thank you for bringing her home, and uh, sorry for the trouble. Oh, no. It was a pleasure. Daddy, did you know that there are villages ten times as big as Haven in the outside world? Ten times! Cities, they call them. And in these cities, they have great big walls and towers and castles. Oh, <laughs> to think I was worried. <laughs> you can tell me all about the outside world later, sweet pea. Now go and help your mum with the stores. All right. Get to work, child. <laughs> Thanks for putting up with her questions. She, uh, has a lot of them. One of the big ones being, what are the people beyond the wall like? Reckon you've made a good first impression. Are we the only ones she's ever met? That you are. The rest of the world can't know we're here. So we'll have to be very careful who we're letting in and out. Oh, wait, that means that other people have been let in there. Trip to shore for supplies, At some point. For the most part, we make do with what we've got. Yeah, including okay. what the old northern has left us. Yes. You built on top of the old ruins, didn't you? Well, they make for fine foundations. Their masons clearly knew what they were doing. I mean, it would make sense. That's one thing we don't have to worry about. <laughs> oh, it's everything else that's the problem. Medicines, metals for tool making. I'm thinking that there's like more that. than just this. We have bit. to dress up as traveling merchants and make a trip to the outside and pray to every cloud in the heavens that nobody sees through us. Uh, which explains why you need Gil. Aye. And now Rook is back, my wife should be free to assist you with any potential purchases. So please, do make good use of our stores. Because we fully intend to make good use of your coin. <laughs> I'll be sure to keep my purse strings loose. So far, most of these people haven't been, like, absolutely crappy, except the, um, the elder of the village. Okay, so now we have our crafting, we have our, our shop. Although, if I remember correctly, I can't buy a ton of items because there's, like, very low potion. Thanks for bringing me daughter back. I don't grudge her looking for adventure, but she's got to pull away it like the rest of us. Anyway, now we've got the inventory done, I can attend to my own tasks, like seeing to our visitors' needs. 
So, what's the role you wanted? I will have to charge you. Ooh, ooh something that's actually better, right? Well, uh, if you're sure you need it. Hands up, but health down? Eh. Yeah. New song. Thank you. May it serve you well. I think we can leave all of those. We'll then I bid you go tide. Yo, take it easy, Andre. Have a good night. What do you think the tributary sees in those outside? All right, so that's the quest now. Howdy havoc. How long do you think this bridge has been standing here? Let's go see the wave. Suddenly, there were curls everywhere. Suddenly, there were corals everywhere I looked. Did you hear that? Great. Girl? Hello there, Off Keeper of the, the Forest surge, Gate. Are you? Well, just you stay close to the tributary. We don't want you getting lost in the forest. Thanks. Yes, yeah, so this is the new DLC that just came out on Thursday. This is going to be the end of the content for this. But I've been good. Work, games, streams, all that good stuff. How have you been? There's a pair of ships just up ahead. Ships? But others are we not still fell. leaks from the shore? Yeah, Leviathan sent them inshore, didn't he? I see bugs up there. Widowmaker is nice. A great name. The quickest route to the surge is due east. Yeah, that's Past what's left of a gully. ship. Shula, how did these ships come to be here? Look at the waves. What do you imagine happens when an icon of war yeah. gets angry? <laughs> really, brother? Did you have to ask? <laughs> I gonna fall out? Ah, which one are you playing? I see there's been a decent spread between what people are playing. It's either been three, four, or seventy-six, mostly. Little tarantulas. Oh, um. Well, here's our first run in with these. Four, nice, good choice. Well, so yeah, they added tonberries to this DLC, so. Hey, you. Tonberries. Foul creatures consumed by their hatred for everyone and everything. Everything save sharp knives, it seems. <laughs> Stab, Tonberry. Yeah, they're they're too big. Not a fan. Yeah, back in the three. I'm considering playing New Vegas. All these people talking about it make me really think about playing New Vegas again. They seem to go down pretty quickly. Yeah, they do look like turtles. Just no shell the turtles. We have those big ants. Oh. Oh, that's just okay, that's still the spiders. We don't need to go that way yet. Or Actually, I think they both go the same way. Bro, let's go down this way. Run, Clive. Run. Oh, you can do it. There you go. Yeah, I'd much rather fight the, uh, the backs over here than some spiders. Thanks. Or I'll just whiff. That's fine, too. Oh, just kidding. I'm still fighting spiders, aren't I? Crap. Yeah, okay. Come on, how about just roast them all? Say goodbye to the spiders. Yeah, good work, too. Sweet. Paths beat somewhere. Yeah, there was. I can smell the, the sea. Spot. It's not far now. I'm gonna crest another hill and then have the ocean there. Oh, that thing looks so cool. Look at that. How will we reach the surge? We'll follow the coastline north. 
There's a bridge that'll take us across to the Cape. Wave looks so... I... No chocobo. No chocobo allowed. Might I inquire about the Ray of Light? It's what prevents the surge from being reclaimed by the sea. And Walius by his people. Hmm. A little bit better, like, and I getting these moves together though. Deal, it's already dead. Okay, relax. Yeah, I'm gonna fight those bugs. Oh, maybe not. But the giant bugs too. Well, thanks. Oh, he's running on his own. You said before that the child is bound within the surge. But you've yet to tell us how we're meant to reach him. Hmm. I trust we won't have to hold our breath. <laughs> no. The surge wraps around the cape without engulfing it. If we continue to its tip, there is a path down to the seabed. Oh. And the wave's origin. Bottom of the sea. Right. It won't be the first dominant we've met at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Hopefully it goes better than that time, though. Sort of kicked our ass. The wave. Even the spray from it just frozen. It's not much further now. The path seems well kept. Do you and the villagers often come this way? Only me. Once every new moon without fail. Check up on it is my duty both as village elder and Walius's descendant. But surely no one blames you for what happened. Why should you bear the responsibility alone? You misunderstand. I do it because I want to. To show him that he isn't alone, and that there are still some of us who would see an end to his suffering. Suffering you will soon witness with your own eyes. Oh The forest grows quickly here left unattended the path would be reclaimed in a matter of moons The energy from dominant I would assume Does the light point the way to the child? It does indeed. Uh, Look at all the droplets of water suspended in the How the air. hell did they do this? Where they have remained untouched by time for 80 summers. It's... It's not right. No. It's not. There, up ahead. Oh. oh, not only just the seabed, but the crater. Holy crap. Down in the center. Follow me. What happened?
Oh my god. He's still primed. I'll never forget my first priming. The fear. And I was old enough to understand what was happening. One can only imagine how this poor child felt. He is the victim of an unforgivable sin. Committed by people who saw him as nothing but a means to an end. Turning them into a weapon must like be so the other dumb. Frightened. Then I'll ease his burden. You don't mean. Oh, he can actually take I'm not going to hurt him. Contrary to the tales, I don't go around killing dominance for no reason. What if I told you there was a way to remove Wallace's icon? I tell you, you were a madman. <laughs> it's hard to believe, but, I know. Wow, there's no inact But it can be done. Though, it isn't without his risks. Part of the icon remains no matter what. So, it might still come to violence? I don't know. Yeah, I thought that I lost most of the power. It depends on the dominant. I've seen things end well, and I've seen things spiral out of control. But I do know one thing. Oh, he's talking about... If we turn our backs on this child, there will be no end to his suffering. And I think that a worse fate than the alternative. Don't you? Actually, um, very the whole well. Titan fight. Do what you must. Was after we had absorbed and whatever Titan, happens, wasn't I will own the consequences. Think. Don't be afraid, right. little one. Let me bear the weight. It's fighting back. Interesting. You guys should all maybe move. Hush now. It's going to be alright. Is it done? Right, it means I. I get his powers way earlier than I was expecting. I think so. I can feel the icon inside me. But something's wrong. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Did it also get out? Afraid. He was angry. Music. All right. Let's see what you've given me. How uh, you know? Because it's Final Fantasy games. I've claimed the portion of the Icon Leviathan's essence. Tuning with Leviathan not only changes the elemental aspect of his magic, but allows access to several new iconic abilities, such as Cross Swell, an inescapable rush of water that pummels enemies from multiple angles. Uh, iconic feet Serpent's Cry can use to summon Clive's off arm to a sea spitting serpent capable of dealing precision strikes to enemies at great distance. Square in this state will unleash tridal idle torrent. Multiple bursts of water capable of forcibly knocking back smaller creatures. From triangle will fire a jet of water, a tidal stream at enemies situated just outside melee range. So it turns his arm into a water gun, essentially. Using the attacks to deplete your title gauge, becoming unavailable when the gauge is empty. It will slowly replenish over time, but can be refilled quicker by pressing circle. Oh god, it's like an ATB reload. Okay. Also refilled when doing perfect dodge. 
Using Serpent's Cry, press R1 again while dodging. You have to roll in the air, extending the dodge even further. Oh, so dodge a second time? Okay. Little Leviathan's abilities are available during Leviathan. this raid. No, just a negative, Oop. but a formidable adversary nonetheless. Oops, that's a... Absolutely. That's much closer than I was expecting. Whoop. But there's so much more damage up close. All right. Shotgun of water, though. What is? Oh, it's. Uh, gosh, I keep wanting to call him Jonathan. Are you gonna stop hitting me for that? Almost died during that, but that's very different. That's going to take a little getting used to. Also, the fact that when it's like that, I don't actually have my sword at all. It's just the shots. Is everyone all right? He seems calmer now. You said Walius was frozen in time. But he knew we were here. How? I... I don't know. Uh-oh. He's never reacted to anything or anyone. Until now. Has he been aware all this time? Been bound for nigh on yeah. A century. If he has been conscious from the first, we must remove the seal at once. It's not that simple. I wish it were, but... There's more to this tale. Of course there is. It would be better if I explained back at the village. I see. Boy. Then let's return before it gets dark. I'm sorry, Walius. I will make this right. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.